I'm ready to lift the curse. I've got all the artifacts. Then there is a chance we will soon move against Edern, and you will recover your memory. I'll need your help, sorcerer, to find the right ghosts. Ah, they will find you. The artifact's aura will lure them. Allow them to think, speak, and act. Then you will know what to do. Geralt, there's something else out there. I scanned the battlefield and noticed the visitor's ghost. It's different from the others. It's changed. A drog. I expected as much. Ah. Good luck, Witcher. In one of the safest places in the camp, my friend. The brothel? Mm-hmm. Did you come here to fuck? You gotta be kidding! My friend on his deathbed? I, I couldn't possibly do that. Look around. You're in a whorehouse. In a professional capacity only. How did I wind up here? I found you out in the fields, unconscious. The fog? Gone. Three days ago. Three days? You sure? Mm-hmm. In that time, Roach ventured deep into Kedwen on some secret mission. Managed to go off and come back. Cedric was right. The power within the Battle of Spectres restores memory. Ah. So, did you get a look at another chapter of the epic poem titled Geralt of Rivia? I remember who helped me track down the Wild Hunt. Who? Letho. Foltest's murderer. I saved his life and he knew where to find the Wild Hunt. I don't know if we rescued Yennefer. So, what happened while I was out? Loads. You drove off the fog of specters. Henselt learned of the plot against him and Deathmold lost it completely. We must rid ourselves of that damned mage, whatever the cost. If it were that simple, you'd be Viceroy by now. Mages don't die easily, and you've nothing left to offer. Three years ago, you promised financial assistance. We were to convey information and resist Deathmold and his supporters in most matters. Nothing's changed. But it has! Foltest and Demaven had their throats slit. Someone we know not who wanted to slaughter the unicorn. The situation's fucking tense, and death mode's stronger than ever. More importantly, you've nothing to offer us. The Tamarian treasury is closed to you. Gentlemen, 
You forget what will happen if the King learns of our dealings. We'll not be intimidated, Roach. And remember, you speak to nobles. I've been in Kedwin for three days. Traveled through nearby villages and towns. Saw old friends. Sounded out the mood. Asked for news outright. The people of Kedwin detest Deathmold and his thugs. They await the man who would dare to wring his neck. Someone approaches. Weapons. Easy there. What the swiven hell is he doing here? He woke up and walked over, if I am to guess. We didn't approve this. How did he know of our meeting? Something I'd like to know as well. Geralt? I have my ways. Unimportant. But it is. If you know, others might know. Overheard a conversation between Whistling Wendy and one of you gentlemen. How dare you, freak? I've a wife. It's shut. It's all shut, Roach. We return to our banners to aid the king in battle. Your plot is done, dissolved, having achieved nothing. Gentlemen. How did you ever come to head a conspiracy in a Kedweni camp? It's a long story. Literally. Foltest and I devised the plan three years ago. Shortly after, Henselt burned Sabrina at the stake and appointed Deathmold his advisor. Morale among nobles and officers was low following the failed campaign. We took advantage. I bought them off, gave them political direction. I received information in exchange. What was your aim? To sow some ferment. Prevent any alliance with the Black Ones, and generally limit Deathmold's and Hensel's influence.